22nd. It's currently Monday. I just came back from a weekend of nationals, which is pretty much like an ice hockey tournament that my team has down in Sheffield. And for a little recap, my team lost four games, won one game, tied a game, something like that. So we didn't do too, too hot, but it was a really fun weekend. I'm kind of exhausted from it. My legs are currently dead from playing all that hockey. It was weird because it was like 20 minute long mini games, but several of them, the span of each day. I think Oxford won the tournament in the end, so are we surprised about that? No. As you can see, I already am currently drying out all my hockey equipment. I have to wash my jerseys later. I'm probably going to do a laundry run later today. But yeah, I pretty much have to do that every time I play hockey. Otherwise, it'll stink up. This video is just going to be like a week in my life of revision. Pretty much the same thing as last week, but I got to do a little bit more work than I did last week because I do have a final on Friday, which is like <laughs> so scary. I don't even know if I'll vlog that day. I don't know if I'll just do today, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, so I can just focus on Friday. But yeah, my first final. I'm so nervous. I mean, I've already taken finals back in December, so I'm like, it's not the first time that I'm doing this, but I'm still really scared. I have to actually do some more revision work, especially for my archaeology class, because they want us to have a bibliography for the essays that I'm writing. And I'm like, why? What is the point? What is the point? So I have to prepare secondary reading for that. So that's going to be its own little thing that I need to do. That's pretty much like a week goal. And then over the weekend, I'll focus on my other subjects. I already wrote down my to-do list for the day. I have to also plan out my week. Let me show you from last week. I usually do weekly goals. As you can see, I don't have everything crossed out from last week, which means I didn't finish everything that I wanted to do last week, so I gotta do that this week. So it's totally fine, guys. It's totally fine. We're gonna struggle along. Also, I went to bed at 3, close to 4 in the morning because of when I got back. I got dropped off at, it was sometime around 3 a.m. Went to bed 3.34 ish. So I woke up at 11. Still haven't eaten lunch yet. I might go eat lunch before I go grocery shopping and then tomorrow I can actually completely focus on studying so yeah anyway thank you so much for joining me I'm gonna have some lunch and just eat a sandwich yeah outlines for what I want to accomplish for the week so I'm actually staying accountable for what I'm doing and not just wasting my time every single day which I tend to do. I even was just scrolling on my phone before this but it's totally fine. I unpacked from the weekend. I'm going to attempt to do some more revision and then maybe cook, do laundry after that. It's a pretty boring day but it has to be productive.
morning guys it's now tuesday i pretty much spent the rest of yesterday just doing my laundry doing some seminar work facetiming some people it's a beautiful beautiful day i think it's gonna be sunny today and tomorrow i'm actually gonna get my ear pierced today i'm getting my left helix done it's gonna cost like 30 ish pounds i'm just really excited i'm planning to do all the piercings i want here because it's so much cheaper than doing them in new jersey I'm going with my friend zoe i'm gonna meet her in like an hour ish i'm gonna go to city center and then we're gonna meet up our other friend chloe to do some work i'm gonna try to not stress myself out too too much I'm gonna try to enjoy the sun while i can before i get back into the grind and yeah it's gonna be a really good day have that feeling have that feeling i'm debating wearing the exact same sweater i wore yesterday so if i do decide to do that please please don't judge me i just I'm really obsessed with the sweater guys gosh anyway i'm gonna finish getting ready and then head out the year before <laughs> hey guys here's the final look uh, uh, what do we think let me show yours <laughs> So my camera died halfway through the day and I have no idea why. I picked it up and it was like burning hot so I think I accidentally maybe left it on and didn't notice. So all those other clips were just filmed on my phone so I didn't really film much. But we just came back from the water stones. I was fairly productive, fairly not productive, but it's fine. Let me give you another close up of my new piercing. So cute. See, I was debating doing the gold one. And then I saw the red one and I was like, wait a minute, change things up a bit because I don't want just all gold. Let me just add red and red's my favorite color. So. Yeah, that's the update for now. I'm gonna eat some dinner, be productive again, and yeah. Yesterday, I wasn't as productive as I wanted to be. It's currently 9.38 in the morning. I'm going to try to go out because I know I'm going to be in my room all day on Friday. And it's a nice day out. So I'm going to at least get in some sunlight. I'm going to bring my book. I'm going to try to work here for a little bit first. Cross some things off my to-do list. But you know what? I know I go to this coffee shop literally every single day of my life. I just, I love coffee. And I love coffee shops. And I love studying at coffee shops. So I might potentially go to offshore today again. <laughs>
It's almost 4 p.m. now. I have been so, so productive. I've just been reading my book. I pretty much finished all the mangles I wanted to do today. And now I'm just chilling. It's such a good day out. Oh my god. I can't believe I've never actually studied in this spot before and just chilled and read my book or journaled here. I'm in Kelvin Grove Park right now and it's so lovely. That's my update. I'm gonna maybe edit. dinner did some editing i'm gonna do some seminar prep for my history exam for next week read my book head to bed i'm just kind of tired my revision's going all right it's not too bad it's just dawned on me that my other two exams i'm completely unprepared for so i'm gonna try to do some studying for that and yeah So I've just been spending the morning doing some seminar work. I already wrote three pages and it's only 11.05. Look at my hand. This is literally the state of my hand at the moment. I am going to finish off the morning listening to some Coffee Break French, doing stretches, maybe make lunch, head out again. It's another beautiful, beautiful day today. I have my little roller in so my hair can have that little whooshy whoosh going on. Already got the hoops in. I had my morning coffee. I'm still working on it, surprisingly. I'm just like, is it bad if I go to another cafe today? Because I'm always going to cafes and I spend all my money on coffee. But I love being productive in a good atmosphere, environment. Plus I love coffee or whatever I get and I can be really productive in them. But I'm like, maybe I should go to the library. But then I'm like, oh, is that bad? It's probably bad, but it's fine. It's totally fine. It's for the greater good of my education, so. lunch. I have been so so productive again this morning. I'm debating going to the botanic gardens and potentially study if it's not too cold. I think it might be cold though but the sun is out. I feel like it'd be so nice just to sit outside and study there. I guess I'll see by the time I walk there. Otherwise I'll just end up at the cafe I'm going to. Oh update. I got my final grade back for the essays I have written for semester two and always. Can I just say how proud I am of myself? I'm gonna fingers crossed keep up this A streak for my finals but i guess i'll see how it goes so i'm gonna head out and be really productive nine-ish p.m. I did some editing. I'm gonna do some more seminar work. I did finish everything I wanted to do today, but I do want to be as productive as I can. Oh my gosh, so random though. I had some of the worst period crips of my life about two seconds ago. Fingers crossed they go away by tomorrow because I don't want to be taking an exam with them. They're gone now. I'm going to do seminar work, potentially cook for tomorrow because I don't want to have to be bothered with cooking food in the middle of my test because who knows, it might take me the whole day, even though it's technically supposed to be an hour and a half. It is a 24 hour exam and I usually end up rereading and rereading my essays because that's just how I am. Also random, I think Instagram knows that I'm studying French because all of a sudden all my Instagram reels are in French. And I'm like, this is good because it'll let me practice and understand and like couple my listening skills, yada yada. But why does Instagram know that? But anyway, I'm gonna get to studying. It's 
finally Friday and my exam is today. I made my coffee, I had my breakfast. I'm so nervous. Fingers crossed this doesn't take me the whole day. I'll update you guys after or during my exam how I feel about it, if I'm doing good. I think too many people are currently on the Moodle right now and it's not loading and every other thing that I click on besides Moodle is loading. So this is really stressing me out. essay. I'm going to eat lunch now and then start my other one. I think it's going pretty well. Yeah.